So my name is Reni Horme. I am the CEO of Zora Biosciences, which is a Finnish startup company specializing in lipidomics. And our main products will be diagnostic tests uh, for the global market, mainly the cardiovascular space. The main reasons for us to participate in the, in the EU framework program was the intellectual property rights that are potentially uh, available in these collaborations, also the ability or the possibility to, to work with uh, renowned scientific institutes and, and be part of this network was quite important to us. Well, in the cardiovascular projects, uh, we are analyzing samples from various institutes and we are looking for biomarkers which would be enable uh, better prediction of cardiovascular risk. Such tools will be highly valuable as the health uh, system is spending millions and millions on, in, in cardiovascular diseases and, and we see there's a great health economic benefit uh, for improved diagnostics in cardiovascular diseases. And with our tools we are able then to provide better readouts uh, for diagnosing patients and assessing their risk and hence uh, enabling uh, earlier treatment uh, for these patients. The main benefit for us is the network uh, that we have established in, in, in Europe uh, with, the, with the investigators, uh, very valuable uh, contacts and uh, in addition to that I would say from the company perspective the most important aspect is the intellectual property rights. Uh, these, these have the highest value of course and have to be aligned with the business strategy of the company. When considering joining an EU project, I would say do not do it uh, for financial reasons. Uh, it's, it's too much bureaucracy and you barely cover your costs even if there's a high overhead uh, available to the SMEs. I would say join these projects only if there is a very valuable network of, uh, of collaborators, plus it, it has to fit your business strategy and you must make sure that you get the IP out of the project that will enable you to, to uh, further your business.